This section is a quick reference to highlight the basic programming of the FW200 control. For a more in-depth understanding or complete programming of the control, please refer to the FW200 installation and operating manuals. Please note at any time pressing the menu button will bring you back to the standard display. When commissioning the FW200 for the first time, you must select the display language. Turn the selector up or down to select the language and then press to confirm. The FW200 will request you to set the date and time upon initial startup. To do this, turn the dial to adjust the time and date, and then press the dial to finalize your selection. You'll be asked about system configuration, which is only necessary if you have added controls. If you see this prompt, press and hold the menu button until it disappears. To set the date and time after initial programming, push the menu button once in release. On the display, vacation will be highlighted. Turn the dial counterclockwise until general settings is highlighted. Push dial once and release. Time and date will be highlighted. Push the dial again and time will be highlighted. Set time by pushing the dial and rotating. Once complete, push again to lock in time setting. Turn the dial until date is highlighted. Set date by pushing dial and turning to select. Push dial once to lock in date settings. Set the controller for constant heat, in other words, no night setback. This can be done in two ways. First, you can turn the selector to the comfort symbol. Second, you can change the programming. To change the programming, press and release the menu button. Vacation will be highlighted. Turn the dial one click counterclockwise to highlight heating and then push the dial to select. Program will be highlighted. Push the dial to select. Activate will be highlighted. Turn the dial one click to highlight edit and push dial to select. Program A will be highlighted. Push dial to select. Replace with present program will be highlighted. Turn the dial counterclockwise to display all days and push the dial to select. P1 will be highlighted. Press the dial again and display will flash. Turn dial one click clockwise to 12 p.m. Press the dial and rotate it until comfort appears. The area around the display should fill in. Press the dial again and lock in your program. Press the menu button and return to the main display. There are three separate default presets as far as heating systems. Baseboard, radiators, and radiant floor. They have an approximate base point of 75 degrees Fahrenheit. With this base point, the heating system will take some time to raise the room temperature in warmer weather. Please see the FW200 manual for more details on these presets. To program a custom preset, press and hold down the menu button for about 5 seconds. System configuration will be highlighted. Turn the dial counterclockwise to highlight heating parameters and push the dial to select. Heating circuit 1 will be highlighted. Press dial again and heating circuit type will be highlighted. Press dial and radiators will be highlighted. Press dial again and radiators will flash. Turn the dial to choose baseline design temp and push dial to select. Heating circuit type will again be highlighted. Rotate the dial counterclockwise. Baseline will be displayed. Press the dial and 78 degrees Fahrenheit will flash. This is your minimum supply temperature at 68 degrees Fahrenheit outdoor temperature. Set accordingly and press dial once to lock in the setting. Rotate the dial and design temp will be highlighted. Press the dial and 168 degrees Fahrenheit will flash. Use tables one and two to choose which temperature to enter. Set accordingly and press dial once to lock in the setting. Rotate the dial counterclockwise to display maximum heating supply temperature. Press the dial and adjust as desired. Push dial once and lock in the setting. Press the menu button and return to the main screen. To adjust the warm weather shutdown, press and hold the menu button for about 5 seconds. System configuration will be highlighted. Turn the dial one click counterclockwise to highlight heating parameters and push dial to select. Heating circuit one will be highlighted. Turn the dial counterclockwise until heating off at outdoor temperature is displayed. The default is 68 degrees Fahrenheit and is adjustable from 37 degrees Fahrenheit to 77 degrees Fahrenheit. Turning above 77 degrees Fahrenheit will move it to 210 degrees Fahrenheit, which disables the warm weather shutdown. Push the dial once to lock in the setting.
To restore to factory defaults, hold the delete button and the menu button simultaneously for about 10 seconds. A countdown display will appear. This will restore factory defaults. The only program that will be held is the date and time.